Hi, welcome to Construction Cronies. My name is Chris Conkle and today I'm going to be teaching you how we fire rated the hallway ceiling and prepared the strips for the walls. You know that we're putting half inch res bar sound bar on the wall for the double air 5.8s. Um, we're going to be preparing the, we're doing the fire rating now ahead of time so that the electrical and mechanical um, can get in ahead and do all of the their stuff. <sighs> and then we'll come back in at the end and put in a drop ceiling with half inch on it, which will, I don't know if you've seen the video or if it's coming up, but it, it is in this series. So keep watching uh, all the videos. If you need to come, go to the start of the, vi the video series right here. I'll leave a link um, and you can catch up if you miss them. Um, but yeah, so it's double layer 5 eighths on the ceiling with a strip, okay? Uh, we're keeping the same size of strip the whole way, making it easy. Uh, it doesn't have to be very tight because we're putting double layer 5 eighths and another half inch. So that's an inch and three quarter out from the wall, okay? So there's gonna be another extra inch and three quarter of material on the wood two by six, okay? So it doesn't have to be super tight at the top. This is for fire rating, guys. This is not for finish at all. This is simply just to fire rate it. Uh, so the strips will encase the plumbing, mechanical, electrical, if you understand what I mean. <clears throat> so that typically what they'll do is they'll come in ahead. Uh, we'll go. Uh, sorry, we'll come in ahead uh, after the framers and drywall and fire tape, and then they'll come in after do all the stuff that they need to do, and then we'll drop another ceiling uh, underneath it. So. Uh, if you can imagine, it's this is just encasing that uh, all that electrical and plumbing and stuff, right? For fire rating. I'm, we've done the fire rating on the top, so there's double double layer five eighths on the lid. We came along, we did all the fire rating first, so we did the double layer lids and all the strips along the wall. Uh, there was a 16 inch piece of ha uh, half inch, 16 inches wide. Then there was a five eighths, 14 inches wide, and then another five eighths that was six inches wide. Um, so when that was step one, so the fire rating, right? <sighs> but yeah, this is what it looks like before it's drywalled. We're going to be doing an elevator shaft as well, so make sure you stay tuned for that. This elevator shaft right here. We're going to start it on the sixth floor and work our way down. But yeah, and we have all these are for fire dampers, right? So when we draw all over with our strips, we're gonna be routering them out. I'm gonna use the quarter inch guide point for that. We're doing the lids on the hallways, the exact same as anything else, the walls or whatever. Always lay out a bunch of sheets to start, right? So you don't have to stop and load and then screw, lift and screw in whatever. You just load and then put them on, simple, right? All right, guys, I want you to pay attention to this. When you're putting on lids, I want you to remember to always be facing the butt joint, okay? Be facing the joint or facing the wall that you're going into. Your partner and you should be looking in the same direction, okay? Always be on the white side of the board and never on the brown side, okay? So if you put yourself on the brown side, that puts you in between the board and the wall or the board and the ceiling, so don't do that. You need to be in sync with your partner, okay? okay? It's very, very important. You guys can really hurt each other if you're not in sync, okay? So practice and, and communicate uh, on how you're going to do things with your partner, all right? Um, the screws on the first layer, you don't have to put a lot of screws in, a, in the first layer. On a 12-foot sheet, eight screws even is going to do, okay? You're going to be screwing it off with two-inch screws on the finished layer. Because this is double layer 5 8 we're going to have inch and a quarter screws for the first layer, two inch for the second layer. On the walls, because we have three strips, okay, we have an inch and three quarter out, we're going to be using the, uh, the three inch screws. Uh, so there's three different types of screws that we're using for this fire rating. Go eight inches in the bevel, 
16 in the field, and that is good. You're using two inch screws, double layer five eighths into wood. It's super strong, so go eight inches in the butts, and uh, 16 in the field is good enough, okay? And it's also important too when you're lifting the board with your partner that you guys are not too far apart so that the middle of the board sags in, right? You gotta position yourself properly so that you you don't break the boards as well. So keep that in mind. 12 foot sheets are long. You can see here my partner using a pole. If the sheet's too much for you, then you can get help with poles, things like these poles here. Uh, I could uh, leave an Amazon link in the video description for you guys if you guys want are interested in getting these poles. There's really kind of helpful for, for new guys who are just getting used to the board because a 12 foot sheet is quite heavy. When you're about to do a job, uh, check to see what type of sheets you have. Here we had 8 foot and 12 foot sheets. So we used the 8 foot sheets on the first layer and the 12 foot sheets on the second layer so that the taper has less joints to tape. So always keep that in mind, the size of sheets that you're using. When you're drywalling a hallway like this, it's always a lot of traffic, so make sure you're safe and you're communicating with people. Another trick too, before you put the sheet on, always have a screw loaded in the gun, ready to go, okay, at all times. It'll really, really help. <laughs> right on, bro. Cheers. Double stud. Oh, fuck. Are we stable? Um, I don't know. I'm good. Oh, it's really good. Yeah. Oh, it's really good. Oh, it's really good. Oh, she is completed. A little different than the other ones we did with the elevator area and stuff. We got this beam, right? We had to build it out so it'll match top layer of the wall here when it's done. So it's all nice and fuck three layers on the one side. But um, yeah, duct, beam, and the electrical closet, the ceiling. But yeah, that's it, man, that's it. Oh. God, complete. So when you're doing your corners and stuff, make sure you stagger them so they're all finished neatly and stuff, okay? Um, the top layer, we're using three inch screws, so. Um, but yeah, it's fire rating, so it doesn't have to be the best, prettiest thing, but, uh, you know, it's got to be good enough. But yeah, guys, I heard it's 6 o'clock. I'm going home. <laughs> hey, man, what's up? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video guys if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe right down below and hit that bell notification icon so you don't miss when I upload these awesome videos if you uh, YouTube thinks you might like this video right here guys so give it a watch this is Chris bye for now everyone Whew.